Brent, you knew I was standing almost knee deep in snow. I now I'm knee deep in snow, but this is actually a sidewalk in front of one of the many quaint shops and restaurants here in town. You see a little bit tough to navigate, but that could change as of tonight. A notice from the police department, town of Groton takes care of this area. The sidewalks, the parking spaces could be taken care of overnight. Plenty of challenges everywhere. Public works crews hard at work in the Mystic Business District on the Stonington side of the river, carting the white stuff away. It has been a little rough being closed for a couple of days, but I anticipate we'll be very busy coming in the next few days with the uh, snow removal. Um, they've been very busy out there today. That jeweler likely losing out on about 50% of their weekly business because of the storm. But Mystic Sift Bake Shop is one business not hurt terribly by the weather. You see, they were closed last week for remodeling. Sunday morning, we had a two hour delay. We opened at 9 a.m. and we were open ready to go, line out the door. Then taking a break from shooting this beautiful snow cleanup video, my photographer Bill Sibaldi said he'd be right back. Next thing I knew, he's helping a mystic man shovel out his sidewalk. We we're lucky it's not any heavier, but it was plenty heavy enough. It took several hours to get through this. OK, OK, I didn't help, but at least I shot the video. New London's Parade Plaza full of snow mounds. One of the biggest remaining challenges in the Whaling City, plowing some of the tight streets. A tough task, especially with snow covered cars. With a shoveling out the cars, um, some people take it and throw it out in the street, and it makes it difficult for traffic and emergency vehicles to get through. Bruce is a good dude. He's been doing that work in New London for some 30 years. So again, this is some of the sidewalk trouble that hopefully will go away tonight. Let's see what we can, you know, this right here is where the edge of the road is, where the curb is, and where the parking spaces would start. So. You said they got a little work left to do, Jen and Brent. We're live here in lovely downtown Mystic. I'm Tony Terzi, Fox 61 News.